So Pat, it's your first match back after a week's break and you'll be facing Yorkshire Carnegie. What will you be expecting from them? I mean, uh, they're a team that likes to play wide, so they go out the back quite a lot. Um, so we'll be practicing our go slow, go defence to counteract that. Um, they've got good forwards as well, so imagine Heinze and the forwards have been working on how they're going to nullify them. So, it should be good. You're currently Bedford's top try scorer. What have you been focusing on to ensure you can add to your tally this weekend? Um, I mean, we're always working on our speed and our strength in the gym and stuff like that. So that always helps to help get to the line there. Aside from that, I mean, it's more just quick moves coming off. Hopefully put me through a hole and hopefully I can finish them. Last time you met at Goldington Road, Bedford proved victorious with a 15-10 win. Are you confident of exacting the same result this Sunday? I mean, I think we've got a good chance of beating them. I mean, last year when we went up there, it wasn't a very good game. Um, but there's no reason why we can't win it. I mean, we're targeting to win at least five of the last six. So hopefully this will be a good start to that. Carnegie is sitting just one place below you in the table, but on the exact same number of points. How vital will a win be for the team? Oh, it'll be massive to just put a little bit more of a gap between us and the bottom and uh, obviously get us a little bit closer to that fourth place spot. I mean, if we do win those five of the six, there's no reason that we won't be in the playoffs, so that's got to be the goal.